by Strike Customs. We're here with the self I Go and um, a couple of the solutions that Strike sells. Um, and um, I'm just going to explain the difference between them and how they work. What we've, cla- what we've got here right now is a classic uh, self I Go setup. This is the Strike B2 antenna. So as a general rule, this would be up on your bull bar or um, or mounted somewhere on your vehicle um, to grab that extra signal. It comes down into the cell fire booster, which helps boost the signal. Uh, You'll see this one here is powered by a um, secret lighter adapter. And then if we come along here, this is the traditional setup. This is a little uh, antenna that goes inside your car that radiates the signal back. Um, We've done some testing with these devices and we've got an alternative. Whilst that's a wonderful setup and we think it works really well, um, if you want the very best setup uh, that's, that's available for, for boosting, um, we've developed that so it comes into one of our striker cradles itself and it works like this. So essentially, we're replacing that antenna that will go inside your car that's radiating the signal. And we've got a cable there that has the SMA connection that goes onto the uh, self I go there. And then the other end is an FME connection. It goes directly to any strike cradle that has an antenna, internal passive antenna with it. So essentially what we're doing is we're grabbing a signal straight out of this booster, running it down a short cable here and straight into the back of the cradle, uh, giving the best chance of a signal boost. One thing that's really important, and the guys at Cell will tell you this and will tell you this every day of the week as well, is that if there's not a mobile phone signal where this antenna is, this thing cannot magic up a signal, okay? They're a wonderful product, but it can't invent a signal. So um, what's really important is there is some kind of signal to boost, and that's why we recommend using a B2 as well, because it's your best chance of picking up that signal. We hope this makes sense. We're going to do some videos out on the road displaying the difference in signal return to a handset or to a mobile phone um, uh, with the different setups. We hope you find that helpful, and we hope that's clear. Thanks.